Hey guys, Pat Dibley here. About six or seven years ago, I finished up an arts degree and since then have gone on to pursue a master's in exercise and nutrition science and then started a business around health and wellness that I'm truly passionate about. So I wanted to share a couple of ideas that have helped me in that time and that can hopefully help you as you make your next decision. The first thing for me was to follow my bliss. I had gone and done geography and economics in arts because I didn't have a clue what I wanted to do finishing school. But I realized finishing the degree, I had to find something I really cared about and that was health and wellness. So I switched over and did a master's in exercise and nutrition science. So figure out what you want to do and go in that direction. Don't do things for security or a paycheck, do it because you love it. Second tip, there's always a way. So like I said, I did an arts degree and then I switched over to a science master's. That's something I didn't realize was possible until I started researching all the different options. So whatever it is you want to do, there's always a way to get out in there and get it done. Third tip would be, now is the time. So oftentimes we think that, you know, we'll do it in the future, we'll go and do something we care about in the future. But for me, I had to draw a line in the sand and say, you know, this is my life, I'm living it now, I'm young, I can take chances, I can go after things, I can make mistakes. My first fitness business failed miserably, but I learned so much by just going out there and doing it. So those are my three tips as you finish up your degree and take your next steps. For me, it was a master's and then starting a business. For you, it could be different, but whatever it is, do what you're passionate about, find a way and uh, make it happen.